six different classes, two teams from Hampton Roads, Lake Taylor in Class 4, Phoebus in Class 3, a combined nine state championships between the two schools in the last 17 years. One game is in the books, one in progress, and Nathan Epstein is covering the action, and he joins us live from Lynchburg with the latest. Nathan. Thank you very much, Brian. Yeah, a very uh, cold Lynchburg, shall we say, as two teams, Lock Lake Taylor down from to the 45 yard and line. Phoebus from Hampton, going for state championships today. As a matter of fact, Lake Taylor is taking on Woodgrove from Northern Virginia right behind me, and right now it's a very close game. We got a five-point game, and earlier today, the Phoebus Phantoms from Hampton, they haven't won it in a while, going to trying to stay perfect. They've won. They've been to seven state championships, trying to make it eight for eight. Two 13 and 1 teams, Phoebus looking to go a perfect 8 and 0 in state championship games. First quarter, we're tied at seven. Third down for Heritage in the white jerseys, and for the second straight drive, Jabari Blake busts it. 69 yards to the house. He's getting a number of Division I looks. Phoebus almost playing a true road game in front of the Heritage home fans, trailing 17 7 at the half. Third quarter, here come the Phantoms. Chris Daniels to Barry Hargraves Jr. for a 62 yard touchdown. It's a three point game. Fourth quarter, Heritage again stretches the lead back to 10. Blake with his third rushing touchdown of the game. He also led his team with 177 yards on the ground. Phantoms need a little bit of magic in the four minutes left to play. Perfect play design. Daniels hits Kamari Gray for the touchdown. Extra point though, no good, but it's still a four point game. Last minute and a half, it's fourth down and three for the Phantoms. Daniels trying to keep his team's title hopes alive. It's intercepted, and that's your ball game. Heartbreak for the Phantoms. Tough loss, man. I mean, you know, I, I'm proud of my guys and the way they fought to the very end. You know, um, now, ladies and gentlemen, back in had the opportunities, to the had opportunities today to win the ball game, and uh, you know, you tip your hat to those guys. They kept fighting. We fought all season. We we scratched back in every game all season. So, you know, you, you don't always win on. You don't always end on top. You know, we you always plan to win. You always plan for the good things to go the way that you want them to go. But I mean, the message to those guys is, man, in life, things like this are gonna happen. You know, you're gonna set out for some out some. For some things Number in life, maybe be some Jabari obstacles, Blake. man. And, you know, you may come up short, but you know, you got to stay resilient. But your next to keep fighting. Thomas